because the proof is in the pudding. So here I am. I just uh, put in that uh, alternator and we were back to 14.1 because my battery is low. So, but we can see now the alternator is charging here. Yeah? The voltage is above 14, uh, 14, which it should be 14 to 14.5. Um, so my battery was drained before, so I need to charge my battery. And uh, but what I was showing you is that look, the alternator is now working. So BMW fans, when you buy these cheap uh, model Amazon stuff, uh, the parts they put back in there can be the problem. See, some that's why I prefer the dealership sometimes with the parts. Anyway, so I Jerry. You know, I'm a bush mechanic from Africa, I just fix it as we go, so this is how I'll do it if I was stuck in the middle of the bush. I just took from another uh, alternator and now the car is running well. Let me show you on the inside. I just need to clear that check engine light. AC is running. My uh, alternator is charging. I am happy. All I spent was a hundred bucks uh, to fix this whole system. And I had to make a little tweaking to make it work. But hey, BMW fans, if you don't know now, you know. This is how we fix this. Now stop going to all these stupid um, Bima Fest. And people ask too many questions. They don't even give any solutions. So many people have posted videos on how you fix this problem. Just change the regulator. And there you go. We're riding. We're rolling. Yeah. See, AC is working. It's under load. The lights are on. I just need to clear the check engine line. Uh, which I can do in a minute and I'll show you when I take it for a test drive so BMW fans don't have to go to the dealership you can fix it yourself yeah